What is an Earth Angel? Um, an Earth Angel is someone who is in human form now, but in their previous lives and existences, they come from other realms, planets, um, dimensions. So they were previously fairies, angels, mermaids, and star people, also known as, I suppose, aliens, who have come from other planets. I mean, you're literally talking my language right now. <laughs> um, and when did you first know that you were an Earth Angel? So I came across the idea of it 10 years ago. Um, I happened to be dating somebody who told me about it, and at first I thought it was completely ridiculous. I thought, right, okay. I thought he was a little bit crazy. Um, <laughs> but once I read more about the topic, and I, I, reading about the different types of Earth Angels made me feel like somebody had written it about me. And you identified with yes, that. Yes, absolutely. So, so <clears throat> the, the, uh, an Earth Angel is someone who has, in their past life, been a mermaid mm -hmm. or been a fairy mm -hmm. or, or come from another planet. But, but, you know, what about the people in this room who are not Earth Angels? Um, have, they, have they not? Have they in their previous lives or have they not had any previous lives? What differentiates between you being an Earth Angel and someone who's sadly not? <laughs> well, some souls are younger than others. You know, you have old souls who have had thousands of human lives. Um, they're also known as Earth Angels as well because they have so much knowledge to um, pass express on. and mm -hmm. pass on to people and to help people. Um, so the younger souls here are to experience all the different human... I mean, we're all here for a human experience. Mm. Um, and the Earth Angels are here because from their own perspective, they want to help humans, they want to help everybody. So the angels are here to love unconditionally. When did you know? I found out about 10 years ago that I was an earth angel, but when I was about three or four, I actually had what I'd class as awakening. We have, many people have an awakening now. When I looked at my hands and I suddenly had this like, light bulb, that I was back in a body. And I was sort of really excited. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm back, I'm alive. And I sort of got out of bed, I was like, mum, mum, I'm alive. And she's like, of course you are. I mean, no, you don't understand. I'm back, I'm alive. And she went, of course you are. Now go back. The living now go back to sleep, and I was like, hmm. And so I've always felt I'm seeking something. Who am I? Why am I here? So what? what but why are you here then? So why are Earth Angels <laughs> here? I mean, what, what's to, your purpose? To raise the good vibes on the planet. To to. And how do you do that? By being in our purpose, and we all have purpose, including including non-Earth Angels, everyone, and that is to be happy doing what brings us joy, what makes us feel good, because when we're feeling good, it has that ripple effect, because yeah. everything is energy. It's like a shining beacon of yeah. light, isn't it? And with Earth Angels, we have come back. When I think of why I'm here, I yeah. see the world, and I just want to love it. So, so what, do, what do you do with your, with your gift? I'm an animal communicator, so I help humans and their animals have a deeper connection with each other. Right. And my gift is to... That's my gift, and it's to be shared with the world to help people wake up to the fact that we are all sentient beings and that my soul can connect with an animal's soul and I'm able to communicate so on that level. I mean, this started very young for you, didn't it? Because yes. you were 11 <laughs> uh, and you, the first thing you saw was your, your friend's mother's ghost. Yes. Was it, but it, wasn't, it didn't scare you? It didn't No, you? not at all. I just... My... The, the things, the weird things that have happened to me, that, that's my normal. Right. <laughs> OK, fair enough. This is all very normal. Yeah. <laughs> um, and how do you spot an Earth Angel? How, I mean, are there Earth Angels in here that maybe... Get... Are you so far? <laughs> we are. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Are we now? You yes. are. Yes. Yes. Earth okay. Angels are very yeah. much like their namesake. So for anyone who's got the angelic influence, they look like angels. I mean, I can see very clearly yeah. that you're an Earth Angel. Absolutely. Philip has definitely got an elemental realm. Earth Angel. <laughs> but why don't I know? I want to know Because that. when we're born, we have yeah. spiritual amnesia. We forget. And we have to remember. We yeah. have to start yeah. remembering. So this will help make make wake up many people. And I think, oh, I've always loved angels. I've always loved fairies. And and to look into it a little bit more. And it's a little bit learning about ourselves. When we understand more about ourselves, then we can understand why things have happened to us and why we are like we are. See, I I I think you're all three of you are absolutely lovely. You're calming. <laughs> you are you are lovely people. But you say I am an earth angel. I'm a massive sceptic. So how can Perfect. I be a sceptic? <laughs> <Perfect. laughs> yeah, I love absolutely. the people are sceptics. Literally, when I heard about Earth Angels, all the spiritual stuff I believe in now, I first thought was mental. <laughs> and you have to experience these things for yourself, you know, and it's... I don't feel journey. like an angel. No, but oh, that's the thing. I actually put a video out because we, uh, I'm, you know, I'm from the angelic realm and many other things as well. I'm not just a, a, an angel, so to speak. But we are not here to be perfect. We're in a human experience. Yeah. I mean, but aren't we not fulfilling our role? If we're not, if we don't know, and we're not aware that we're angels. We must be we? a massive we disappointment. We must no, be not, not at all an angel. Absolutely no, not no, no, not all an angel. You are when you are passionate about what you do, when you love what you do. You are on purpose.
Yeah, so whether absolutely. you're aware of being an Earth angel or not, you're still doing the work you came here to this planet to do. My vision is sort of angels in my head. I'm not dissimilar, white, gorgeous, wonderful. But do you have like bad days? I mean, oh, do you get yeah. <laughs> yeah, rage? Do you get road absolutely. rage? Do you like road rage? Road I swear a lot. Yeah. 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 So yeah. that's yeah. okay. Yeah, absolutely. We're yeah. here to be perfect. We're a human experience. We are not here to be perfect. Yeah. yeah. At all. And that's all part of the whole experience. But you must be so disappointed in. All of us, not, not us, all. because we're angels. Obviously, you're obviously. obviously. We're not the team. <laughs> not, you know, but no. but not we, we, you know, all. our first interview today, where we're talking about children who who won't be friends with someone who has some mm. sort of disability or disfigurement. We started out. If ever there was an Earth Angel hashtag, it's our Be Kind campaign. Yes. Uh, but there are still people who are so cruel to each other, so mean. That's hu why we're here. That human beings, so many, can mm. actually just be naturally mean. And that is why. Earth angels, light workers, whatever you want to call it, are here. That's yes. why we're here because, yeah. and we have to remember who we are. Mm -hmm. We have to heal what we need to heal within ourselves. We have to do and be on purpose and do what makes us happy and brings us joy. And, and it has the light, effect. Look, we? all the Earth angels on the planet that the work we've done, we're on national TV talking about Earth angels. That so shows the shift.